We believe that God is real because He has revealed Himself to us in three ways, through creation, the Bible, and His Son, Jesus Christ. First of all, God's existence is evident in all that He has created. Because God's invisible attributes, His everlasting power and divine nature, have been plainly seen and understood from what has been made since the creation of the world, so that men are without excuse, reads Romans 1.20. Parallel to this, Psalm 19.1 says, The skies proclaim the work of God's hands, the heavens declare the glory of God. Similar to how a watch discovered in a field would point to a designer, the universe's complex structure points to a creator. The Earth's precise rotation and our cells' intricate DNA both suggest the existence of a great designer. Second, there is an inherent morality and feeling of eternity in humanity that suggests a greater force. God has imprinted eternity on a person's heart, according to Ecclesiastes 3.11. Every culture in history has developed moral principles that are strikingly similar and has a sense of good and evil. This universal morality suggests that we were imbued with these ideals by a supreme moral being. Furthermore, the fact that worship has always been done in some capacity by people everywhere suggests that a higher force is acknowledged by all. This supports the notion that God made humans in His likeness. Genesis 1.27 Thirdly, the Bible is how God has revealed Himself. Scripture presents the existence of God as a reality that should be obvious. For example, Genesis 1.1 does not try to establish the existence of God. It only says, In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The integrity, transforming power, and accompanying miracles of the Bible point to a supernatural origin and call for more investigation. God finally made Himself known via Jesus Christ, His Son. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, according to John 1 1 14. Jesus lived an amazing life, performing miracles, fulfilling prophecies about the Messiah, keeping the whole Old Testament law completely, and exhibiting great compassion. The Word became person and established his residence among us. Witnessed by hundreds, his resurrection three days after his crucifixion is a powerful indication of His Godhead, 1 Corinthians 15, 6. The idea that Jesus is divine is supported by historical evidence of His life and resurrection. As Hebrews 11, 6 states, the question of whether God exists ultimately boils down to faith, even if skeptics may interpret the evidence differently. A person must choose for themselves to believe in God based on the evidence of His creation, His Word, and His Son, Jesus Christ.